Welcome back for another 5-minute movie recap. Today, I'm going to give you an overview of the 2019 South Korean thriller film called, Parasite. The plot revolves around an impoverished family who devise a strategy to infiltrate a wealthy family's residence by posing as unrelated, highly qualified professionals. Warning. There will be spoilers ahead, so please proceed with caution. The story revolves around the Kim family, which includes the father, Ki Taek, the mother, Chung Suk, and their two children, Ki Yung and Ki Woo. They struggle to make ends meet in a cramped semi-basement apartment with low-paying temporary jobs as pizza box folders. Min Hyuk, a university student and family friend, presents the family with a scholar's rock, which is said to bring good fortune. As he prepares to study overseas, Ki Woo proposes that he disguise himself as a university student and take up his work as an English teacher for Da Hai, the daughter of a very wealthy family known as the Parks. After meeting with the Park family and posing as a Yonsei University student, Ki Woo succeeds in impressing the mother and is hired to start immediately. The Kim family devises a strategy to secure employment for each member of the family by acting as unrelated and highly skilled professionals in order to serve the Parks as servants. Ki Yung impersonates Jessica and works as an art therapist for the Parks' little son, Da Song, using Ki Woo as a model. Mr. Parks' driver, Yoon, is accused of having sex in the car by Ki Yung, who subsequently suggests Ki Taek to take his position. Finally, Chung Suk takes over as the Park's housekeeper after the Kims utilize Mrs. Park's longtime maid, Moon Peach Guang's allergy, to convince her that she has TB. Ki Wu and Da Hai begin a covert love connection. When the Parks leave on a camping trip, the Kims enjoy the comforts of their home until Moon Guang comes at the door and informs Chung Suk that she has forgotten something in the basement. Moon husband, Guang's Jun Se, has been hiding from loan sharks for almost four years and she finds a concealed entrance to an underground bunker constructed by the architect and previous owners. Moon Guang begs Chung Suk to help Jun Se stay in the bunker, but the eavesdropping Kims inadvertently disclose themselves. Moon Guang records them on her phone and threatens to tell the Parks about their ploy. The Parks return home early owing to a heavy downpour, and the Kims hurry to clean up the house and control Moon Guang and Jun Se before they arrive. Jun Se and Moon Guang are cornered in the bunker by the Kims. Mrs. Park tells Chung Suk about Da seizure inducing Song's horrific experience on his previous birthday, when he saw a ghost, really Jun Se, emerge from the basement late at night. Before the Kims can get out of the house, they overhear Mr. Park making snide remarks about key odor. Taek's the Kims' flat is flooded by sewage water, forcing them to seek refuge in a gymnasium with other displaced individuals. The following day, Mrs. Park, with the aid of the Kim family, organizes a party to celebrate Da Song's birthday. Meanwhile, in the basement, Jun Se discovers his wife's dead body, she had died from a concussion she sustained during the previous battle. Ki Wu enters the basement with the scholar's rock. He is assaulted by Jun Se, who bludgeons his skull with the rock and flees, leaving Ki Wu lying in a pool of blood. Jun Se escapes the basement, and upon seeing the party, he grabs a kitchen knife and stabs Ki Yung in order to revenge Moon Guang. While watching the chaos unfold before them, the party attendees begin to panic. When Da Song sees Jun Se, he has another seizure, and a fight ensues until Chung Suk fatally impales Jun Se with a barbecue skewer. Mr. Park instructs Ki Taek to drive Da Song to the hospital, ignoring the fact that Ki Taek is trying to assist Ki Yung who is now heavily bleeding on the floor. In the midst of the turmoil, failing to see the severity of the situation, Mr. Park has a disgusted reaction to Jun Se's body odor. Ki Taek, enraged by Mr. Park's lack of empathy, seizes the knife and murders him. After that, Ki Taek departs the scene, leaving the rest of the Kim family behind. Ki Wu is still recuperating from brain surgery weeks later. Both Ki Wu and Chung Suk were found guilty of fraud and sentenced to probation. Ki Yung is dead, and Ki Taek, who was wanted by the police for the murder of Mr. Park, has not been located. Jun Se is thought to be a mentally ill homeless guy, and neither he nor Ki Taek's reasoning for the stabbings have been revealed. Meanwhile Ki Wu observes the Park's home which has now been sold to a German family that is oblivious of its past, and notices a Morse code message from a flickering light. Ki Taek, who gained access to the bunker through the garage, buried Moon Guang in the backyard and now raids the kitchen at night and flickers the light every day in the hopes of catching the attention of Ki Wu. Ki Wu writes a letter to Ki Taek, still living with his mother in their original basement flat, promising to work hard enough to one day buy the home and reconcile with his father. If you like this movie, click the link in the description below to watch it today. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Hit the like button and subscribe for more videos. Have a great day ahead.